In the last month, I've had a couple of fusion hybrids come in with the same problem. One was a 2009, one was a 2012. The customer's complaint was that the uh, red triangle would come on with a message, stop safely now, and they'd have to pull over to the side of the road. Both of these cars had the same codes in them. Uh, and those were P0A3E and p one a14 P0A3E indicates that all three of the generator inverters have experienced an overheating condition. The most likely cause for this is an issue with the cooling system for the electronics. P1A14 is an informational DTC. It just indicates that there's been a problem with the system that has forced it to go into a limited or a fail-safe mode or to shut down. And normally most of the electronics on these cars, including the generator, run about 160 degrees. But when, when this problem was occurring, uh, the electronics on this car were running up to 260 degrees for the generator inverters. For the hybrid electronics on these, they run their own cooling system. On both of these cars, it turned out to be an issue with the electric water pump for the hybrid cooling system. The electric water pump for the hybrid cooling system is located at the back of the front cross member on the subframe. You can see it from the top if you look down. The electric pump for the cooling system is replaced with the car up in the air on a hoist. On the first fusion, the 2009, the pump would stop running, and if you tap on it, then it would start running again. On the second one, the pump was making a chugging noise, or kind of chugging. Uh, it should just be a constant hum anytime the key is on. It wasn't pumping a sufficient volume of coolant. If you enjoyed this video or found it helpful, please give it a thumbs up. It tells YouTube to show this video to more people and helps me grow my audience. Share it on Twitter or Facebook, that really helps. I'm going to try and keep doing this and bring you more helpful and cool stuff. Hope you all have a great weekend. Take care.